show in the post game. This game, much more than X's and O's and points and stats tonight, this was going to be a big character test. A disappointing loss at home Thursday night, and you turn around in less than 48 hours and find any way you can to grind out a win, and you guys did it. I'll tell you what, I'm, I'm going to give a little shout out here to two young ladies. One is Bill Keys at Bill Kadir, the other one is Ramses Lonlack, because I was, um, I was very disappointed in, in their performance on Thursday evening, and I was not shy about letting them know that yesterday in practice. And I'm very proud of them because. It would have been easy for them to not take criticism so well and, and play poorly today. But I thought those two young ladies played their roles incredibly well. And uh, they didn't hang their head about um, a tough day in practice yesterday. They came out and they really, really played. And I think that was the difference in the game. Because when Ramses Lonlack plays defense the way she does, it energizes our team. I thought Kesey led our team. I thought she was willing to step up and take some shots that we needed her to take. I thought they were outstanding. Now I can't also, um, I can't ignore Nicole Dixon. I mean, she was our steady rock this evening. Lauren McGraw, I thought, had gave us great minutes, played the most minutes she's ever played. Thought she was very solid. And every other player that stepped in the game, whether it was Jalen Norris or Jasmine, and then we, I mean, we got to talk about Brittany Carter. Yeah. To be honest with you, she really, I was told before the game today, Melissa, you might have her for four minutes to rest somebody in the first half and four minutes to rest somebody in the second half. And Brittany Carter said, no, I'm playing. But she said that the night she sprained her ankle at East Carolina. So she did what she said she would do. Well, she didn't favor the ankle at all. And late in the game, you, you pulled her out. And I could hear the conversation when you asked her, "Are you? is that it? Are you done for the night? And she's like, well, no, I may have accidentally thrown my hand up. I'm ready to go right back in. Well, you know, it's kind of a touchy situation. I mean, Brittany really, Brittany didn't even go through a shoot around this morning. Right. She has not played since she went down at East Carolina. And so she's willing to go. She was fully cleared. Her ankle is strong, but it's sore. Yeah. Um, so I wanted to rely on Brittany. It's her senior year. Um, she's earned some input in this program. Now how she plays now, if she wasn't effective, then it would have been no decision. But she was effective. And um, Danny thought she saw her signal out once, and that's why I talked with her. Are you done? I mean, are you, are you done? And she said, no, I'm good to go. So I thought she uh, handled the ball at very critical times late in the game. She went to the ball. She was a good, strong receiver. She dribbled out of traffic. And um, we, we got some ticks of the clock going off when they were fouling.